Master Ceremonies, Hostas Rotolorium, Dr. David Steer, Minister Shaw, Minister Hutchinson, Chairman Myrie, Councillors, my colleague Dave Brown, Superintendent B. Put, Raymond Reed, Parish Manager, ladies and gentlemen, farmers, one and all, good morning. Let me say it's a, it's a happy day. And over for a long time, I've been waiting for such a building. I think, Minister, if you, if you look at where agriculture is in the parish, and if you look at where we're coming from, I think Hanover has probably the most hotel rooms across the country. But in terms of the, the throughput, in terms of between farmers and the hotel sector, the farmers here hardly sell anything to the hotels. And, well, some policy decisions will have to be made there too. And I say that because there, we, don't, we, we haven't created the linkages as yet between farming, the farmers, and the hotel sector. And imports continue to hurt us as we go. Now, I just want to say a couple of things. Um, we have been lucky enough and fortunate enough to get some farm roads across the, the constituency and across the parish, which is good. We have the famous Lucy Yam, which needs to be revived. We, we have what some people say, tumor or tamarack here in the parish that is one of the best you can find across the country. But we still suffer. And we suffer because most of our farmers haven't been able to get a fair shake or a fair break in terms of selling their goods to the hotel sector across this parish. And I'm speaking about Hanover in particular. So if you take Grand Palladium with the thousand rooms out there, I don't think 1% of what they eat or what the tourists come here and consume is produced by the people from Hanover or from Jamaica in particular. And it's something we have to look at. The farmers are ready to work. And, 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 and I think one of the big problems that I've been, I have to have some conversation with Mr. Reed is technology. Most of our farmers here in Hanover have not been able to, to accept and, 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 and work and, and basically how best technology can help them in terms of increasing yield and all of those things. And it's something that we have to look at here in Hanover also. But it's a good day. This building is a staff. The road coming here also, Minister Shaw, I'd ask you if you have anything, forgive me, you know, you say you don't know yet. So the road coming here is a little bit bad too. So, yeah, it's a farm road. <laughs> so, we're going, <laughs> I'm going to put this one to you also. <laughs> so, look, Farming is important, it's important to the people of Hanover. It's the way by which most of you have the opportunity to send your kids to university or for higher education to become much better than you. We have a problem where the kids that we are sending off is not coming back to the parish and they are not coming back to play a role in farming either. So we have some work to do. But as I said today, it's a good start. I want to say as member of parliament that Thanks, this is coming at a timely, it, it is coming now, which is good. And uh, it's an investment that, as I said before, the farmers are accepted of. I just want to make sure that when the building comes, there will be the necessary educational activities in educating our farmers about the new way of farming, about new ways of doing things. And also, in addition to that, how best technology can change the landscape. And as I said, Minister, if we don't do anything else as a parish and as a country, let's create the linkages between the hotel sector and the farmers to ensure that for those that we're given the tax break to enter our shores to operate as tourism interests, the farmers of this country can get something back. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you.